King Charles has no idea, as Harry and Meghan have unfinished business. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have unfinished business in their strained relationship with the royal family, royal commentator says. King Charles has been accused of running out of ideas about what to do with Prince Harry and Meghan Markle and their unfinished business. Meghan and Harry left the royal family in 2020. Although almost four years have passed since the decision was made, the couple has recently made various accusations against the royal family. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British royal family. In a recent report, royal commentator Danielle Elza said, the king's strategy seems to be to do everything in his power, or at least as much as he can, to keep the royal family in line with Montecito Keep. Earlier this year, the king decided to kick the couple out of their UK base at Frogmore Cottage, strategically placing Prince Harry III in line for the coronation. Ms Elza wrote, the king is still in doubt about how to curb Sussex once and for all. Speculation has also grown over whether Meghan will publish her memoirs, which could include details of her time in the royal family. Ms Elza concluded, the king seems to be stuck again and doesn't know how to fix this mess. The relations between the Sussexes and the royal family have soured in the past year, given the release of Harry and Meghan's Netflix docuseries and the Duke's tell-all memoir spare. The Duke, in his book, made a series of claims about his fraught relationship with senior members of the royal family, making them angry with his boasting. The royal family, and the Sussexes' relationship are thought to have consistently worsened since Harry and Meghan ditched the royal family, and relocated to the US in 2020. This year, the royal family has totally shunned Harry, Meghan and their children as they did not even wish happy birthday to Meghan. In June, the royal family's social media also remained silent as Harry and Meghan's daughter, Princess Lilbet, celebrated her second birthday. Prince Archie also did not receive any birthday wishes on his fourth birthday, which fell on the same day as King Charles's coronation in May. The 74-year-old monarch is also being praised for his decision to snub Harry and Meghan from an event marking the one-year anniversary of the Queen's death. Speaking on GB News, presenter Patrick Christie's and royal commentator Kinsey Schofield praised the monarch's decision, making note of instances where he has caved into certain issues and not stood up for the good of the royal family. Royal commentator Kinsey Schofield agreed with the point made by the presenter, saying the monarch has shown backbone with his defiant stance. He said, you are not going to disrespect our family, this is a private time, we're going to mark one of the greatest monarchy in history without you. I think you're right, it shows backbone. The pair no longer have a permanent home in the UK after they were evicted from Frogmore Cottage. If they are not included in any of those plans they will find a way to mark the significance in their own way, a source stated.